Honestly, it's beginning to feel like Donald Trump has already won the 2024 presidential election and 2024 is not even here. Well, this is going to be another update for you. Check it out. New York City to to this. And the only borough with the Hispanic majority. President Biden got 83% of the vote here in 2020. But now the Biden campaign is seeing polls coming out saying President Trump is gaining traction with voters of color, right. even younger voters. So I came to the Bronx to put a face on the numbers, and I was shocked by what I heard on the streets. Do you think that President Biden is doing a good job with the economy? No, he's not doing nothing yeah, to support nobody. Know, is he doing a good job? Yes or no? No, no. I, I can see we're all going to be the streets homeless. Biden and his press secretary said that prices are going down. Is that your experience or is that not true? No, that is definitely not true. Prices are definitely going up. I used to go across the street to Florida to go get me a meal. I can't even get me a meal because that meant $20. <laughs> Minority community. <laughs> That's a laugh of pain. You could feel the pain in the tone. <laughs> Minority communities, we're not seeing the improvement. Uh, I, I, there's inflation with everything. Food, gas, insurance prices. I mean, you name it. Bidenomics is not working. It's, it's just a complete mess. It's a disaster. Especially here in New York City, we're feeling it very hard. You could say anything to Biden right now who says that the economy is improving, especially in black and brown communities. What would you say to him? That's lies. I believe that's lies. Heavy lies on that, for sure. <laughs> Do you think that somebody else besides Biden should be president? Yeah, of course. Time, of course. Uh, bring back Trump. <laughs> Tell me why. Um, we, were, oh, we, were, we have money. We have money when Trump was president. Free my son, Trump. Free Your my son. son Trump. Trump 2024, everybody. Oh, Trump 2023. Okay. That's crazy. And we're here and we're here in the Bronx. I'm gonna vote for Trump if he runs. Because I feel like it was much better when he was here financially for everybody. True. Not just me, for everybody. I'm definitely voting for Donald Trump. He made sure we had money in our pockets. Nope. <laughs> he was for the people. He made sure Everybody's we had Everybody's talking about that money in our pockets. You see, when he was president, people were talking against him. Now he's gone, you miss him and you want the money again. All right what we needed i feel like everything will go back to how it was i mean ever since he's out, I mean, out of office everything's declined say that. when trump was president my life was good e e economical wise i was doing so much better they're saying it's gonna be biden trump so who will you vote for oh i ain't gonna lie i'm gonna have to go for trump sorry i'm gonna go for That's trump, trump. trump. I'm always trump. 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 Here, let me see who are you voting for trump Feeling the pain Trump of price hikes is has the New York flair. Trump. It's <laughs> one thing. But the show of open support for former President Donald J. Trump on the streets of the Bronx was very surprising. Yeah. Definitely, I think it's, it's pretty clear why people are choosing Trump right now. Um, I don't know, but you, you have to remember people are also very gullible and people forget. People tend to have what I refer to last memory because I watch a lot of battle rap. If Biden does something today that favors all those people. I wouldn't be surprised if their perception or their, you know, their comments change again in, in favor of Biden. It might change in favor of Biden again. I don't know. Let's say Biden cancels student loans, cancels mortgages, starts paying people two thousand dollars every month, and go back and ask that question again. They might say Biden twenty twenty four. Maybe. Don't know. We'll find out. Anyways, this is the end of this one. Share your thoughts, smash the like button, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video. Peace.